we are going to find the derivative of x to the power of x. To solve this problem, step number one, take the natural log of both sides. Recall that the natural log of x is the same as log x to exponential base. Likewise, remember that ln is a short form of natural logarithm. Written like this or at times written like this. Hence, we have taken the natural log of both sides. Also, recall that the natural log of a to the power of b is equal to b the natural log of a. That is, this b are the power we come to the front of the natural log. With this concept, this x at the power need to come down to the front of this natural log according to this rule. Next, we are going to differentiate this using implicit differentiation. And we are going to differentiate this side using product rule product because these are multiplying functions next differentiate the natural log of y and we have 1 over y but because we differentiated y and not x the consequences is we are going to multiply it with the y the x according to the rule of implicit differentiation Recall that from the basic derivative table, when you differentiate the natural log of x, you are going to get 1 over x. However, when you differentiate the natural log of y, you are going to have 1 divided by y. However, whenever you differentiate y, you must multiply it with the y dx. But this does not apply whenever you differentiate x. Next, we are going to apply product rule to this function. Next, we are going to keep x constant. Next, differentiate the natural log of x. When you differentiate the natural log of x, you are going to have 1 over x. Hence, the differentiation of the natural log of x is 1 over x. Next, according to product rule, we are going to introduce a plus. Next, we are going to keep the natural log of x constant. Next, differentiate x. Differentiation of x is 1. Next, this x will now cancel out this x. Next, I can rewrite this to become this because dy dx is one entity. Next, the y at the denominator will move over to the other side to multiply everything here. Next, we are going to replace the value of y from the given question. By replacing y with x to the power of x from the given question, this is our dy dx. This answer and this are the same because the natural log of x is the same thing as log x of base e. From the options, our answer is a. Remember, this log x is of base e. This is calculus.